Also here with my good friend Trey Alexander. Hello, Thomas. Guitar. First of all, before we get started, we want to wish you a full and speedy recovery. Definitely. So here's something to work on. In the meantime, on your bass, um, oftentimes when you're playing funk tunes, uh, especially, you get into this one chord groove. Uh, so here's a line I like to play. Uh, we're going to do it in C7. So it's a major chord. Uh, typically we play a lot of minor pentatonic stuff, but I like to play something that brings out more of a, a brighter um, sound, you know, not so much that dark pentatonic thing. So check this out. Uh, I'm gonna use C, obviously that's our root, B flat, and A. And then I'm gonna bottom out on that G. So C, B flat, A, and G. That's the main line, and then at one point I do this little walk. It's a classic old blues walk, but more in the funk feel. So, uh, root, flat seven, six, root, flat seven, six, five, and then that line again with this little blues thing, finishing it off. Check it out. Two, three. I'm leaving a lot of space there. I'm thinking there's keyboards or horns or something. Um, but if you're on, on your own, you know, you could put in dead notes or, or whatever to maybe make it a little funkier even. But right now for demonstration, I'm trying to keep it kind of on the mellower side. It's something you can move as well. Let's say we were in the key of D. So I'm going to go D, C, B. There's that root, flat seven, six. Then D, C, B, A. There's the fifth. We're gonna do that line again. And now the walk up just moves up two frets. There's that blues walk. Let's try that in D. One, two, three. All right, and again, make it your thing. You want to put in dead notes. You want to, you know, make it really funky. Go ahead, but there's something to practice. Have fun, buddy. Take care, man. <laughs> 